I can't believe we're all here. It's been almost seven years since we first joined. Who remembers cats? Yeah. Yeah, yeah I remember that. Do you remember all the slime phases, the bottle flipping phases? And the, um, <laughs> the fidget spinner phases. Yeah, that was great. Oh, do you remember Y2T? That was yeah, so fun. Yes. Oh my god, yes! I hardly even remember year 10 because of Covid, and then we didn't even have proper GCSEs. And then year 12, we have Poland, and now year 13, uni applications, and now obviously setting all our lives now. Yeah. It's crazy, it's, crazy. it's just gone so crazy. fast, like... Okay, this is going to sound really, really cringe, and none oh of you laugh god. at me. Go on. Mind. But it's almost like it's been a movie. Hello. Makes you notice, doesn't it? A little bit of darkness. Refines the senses. Focuses the mind. It's time to enjoy the big screen experience. With no distractions. No sudden ringtones. No glaring screens. No talking. So sit back. Relax. Switch off your phone. And switch off from the outside world. But first, the ads.
Okay there, bud. We're gonna take this nice and slow. Here we go, oh, here we go. Position three, no, four. There's no peace like home. There's no peace like home. There's no peace like home. Evil takes a human form in Regina George. Wonderful, because she may seem like your typical selfish backstab. Ben Lyons have none, so we die our have none. Ben Lyons have none, so we got a Ben got a MacBook, so we got a MacBook. Ben started to chew gum, so I started to chew gum. I'm so cool. So cool, Jack. Oh, Jack. So cool. I think I can get out. You can't. I think there's no space. Okay. There's no space. I'm so cool. I love you. I love you. Well, hello there. Who are you? Based on your vibe, a teacher. You boys, can Look you at how put you your spot people on, not wearing kippa. Why? Why do you care so much? But wait, what are you doing now? What are you doing? Can now you, go to your you have my attention. Coming my way, I see. Here to tell me to go to class, but I can't. You sound fed up, as if you've had a long day at work. I see your struggles. 
I see everything you do. I see it all. Don't get it wrong, I'm not stalking you. I just need to understand you. What makes you tick? Wow, I really loved watching me go. Top Gun. Um, All the you. other ones we filmed. Well, that's great. Great. They were great. That. Right, cool. It's now two months till our A level exams. And I'm drained. I'm so tired. I was up last night till 4 a.m. working and revising through content, and it's killing me. When can it end? Honestly, these last five months have been the best five months ever. I did not think sick form would be this easy. I'd like to issue a public apology to Daniel Jackson. It turns out we are doing. That's our challenge. Okay, you gotta remember, you gotta be grateful to watch him for everything. You gotta serve him with happiness, you gotta be grateful for his kindness, and because we're feeling good for it, just stop it! So Kirsch wrote me a poem. Roses are red, Kirsch loves a Mr. is a massive oh. 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 Skipper, Trevor's my dad. Red. Yes, come on. Yeah. Long video, guys. Yeah. Oh, I turned it off. This one's for my baby. Ella, take me back. I took my top of opponent. Now the shorts are coming off.
I came home yesterday um, from school and my cat was not home and I have reason to believe that he stole my cat. What evidence do you have? Well, I, I briefly went over to his house and there was cat food in his house and he doesn't have a cat. I just like to face the cat food. <laughs> but I really want my cat back. Right, okay. Do you, does your cat care about you? Do you care about your cat? Yes or no? Yeah, more right. than I care about So, him. So I think, you know, because you're in year 13, you should be focusing on your exams and get an A star. Both of you. Right? right? Right, your cat, well, your cat could be here, there, it could be in heaven, oh, who knows? Well, right. I think I need to give my side of the story here. Well, the problem from my side of the story is that, like, whenever I go to his house, he doesn't give me any attention, and all he does is play with his cat. What, can you define what sort of relationship you both of you have? Well, we're, um... We don't like to put labels on it, but I like to think I have a relationship with both him and my cat, but he likes to think I only have a relationship with him. You see, this is the problem here. Him and his cat have had a very strong relationship, and I feel like I'm being excluded from it. I've known my cat longer than I've known you. Yeah, but you decided to go in a relationship with me. Yeah, but I decided to have a relationship with my cat first. But you didn't tell me about this. All I did was I came in your room and I saw you playing with your cat. Give me that. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> right, Wait, so yes. when are your exams? It's in two months, right? You need to be focusing right. on your exams, studying hard to get an A star. Okay? Okay. Right? Does that make sense? Right? Oh well, yeah, but all he does is think about his cat. He doesn't do any revision. All he does is... Have you ever thought that your relationship was unhealthy? It's very healthy when his cat isn't involved. Yeah, when you, when you accuse each other of killing each other's cat. I didn't cat kill it, I just took it. Okay, so you admit taking the cat. Give him back his cat. Uh, it can't um, be given yeah. back now. Why? It's not a cat anymore, it's now a rat. Right. He's saying he's cooked and eaten my cat. Oh. Uh, I wish you all the best, and I hope you all do well in your exams, but please revise. Okay, I've given you a lot of resources, so I want you all revising, okay? So, what was my motto? 3 to 1 A star. 3 to 1 A star. Okay, A star. A star. A star. A star. A star. All right, then. Okay, you can go. Bye. By the way, your cat tastes nice.
So my name is Mr. Smith, and my least favourite student has got to be Sam Ornstein. The reason behind that is he's still doing work that was due in October. Hi, I'm Mr. Layton. My most favourite uh, pupil is Jack Khan. My least favourite pupil in your year group is Sam Ornstein. My name is Mr. Gordon, and my favourite student is Lauren White. And my least favourite student is Lauren White. My favourite student, Steve. I don't have a favourite student. I love you all. Least favourite person? Oh, 100%. Um, percent got to be Guy Friedman. Oh, he drives us nuts. He rolls in, he takes he what he wants. wants, comes to the till, gets in our way. So absolutely drives us nuts. All he ever does is he just moans the whole the time. time. And all we've had to do for the last two years is just this smile. Moan, moan, yeah, moan, yeah, moan, yeah, yeah. Moan. You'll be fine. You'll be fine. No. Best favourite. That ray of sunshine. Lauren. Lauren White. We love Lauren. She's oh, our absolute she's our favourite. 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 How we've we got through the last two years. Joy. She's amazing. She's just great. We're gonna miss her. Amazing. Hi. My name is Mr. Cripps. With regard to favourite students, technically I'm not allowed to have favourite students. So therefore, I don't. I hate them all equally. I'm Mrs. Lean, and my favourite students are anyone who doesn't pass on Hillside. I'm Mr. Clyde. Um, my favourite student has got to be Mooty. He has such a low profile in the lesson. You don't even notice that he slips in, and it's not like he ever, you know, if, if there's two ways of working something out, an easy way and a convoluted way, it's not like Moonty would ever go for the convoluted way. Oh no, no, Moonty's gonna do the really easy way, as opposed to doing a convoluted way and say, Mr. Klein, why don't you do it this way round? My most annoying student has got to be Lexi Mayer. Luminette, that girl, she is so noisy. She is so, she comes in, she's rambunctious. I suppose I should be the polite teacher and say she's got all this positive energy that needs channeling. But like when I ask her a question, she doesn't have to shout the answer at me every time. Good morning guys, today I'm in the restaurant and I've got a special guest joining me today. So I'm going on a date with, and I introduce Bea. Good morning. How are you? Good, how are you? Good, babe. Are you excited for it today? I was sick, couldn't sleep last night. A little bit nervous, dreaming about you. Listen, I think you brought me to a lovely, yeah. lovely setting. This is where you bring all your men. <laughs> yeah, I, I know it very well right here, actually. You know, this is like the prime table, really. The nicest service, you know. Got it, yeah. got it. So I brought you here. Wait hey. up. Yes? Can I take your order, please? I'd like a portion of chips, please. Yes? With a spice of love. Can I have some ketchup with that? Yes, please. Perfect. <laughs> you know, some chips with some love. Thanks so much. And here's my special Thank sauce. You. Thank you. Enjoy. Thank you. Dig in. So what you do for a living? Well, apart from being a full-time stud, um, I just do many things, you know. I work 30 hours a day doing property. Okay. And then the other five hours are for you, Luis. Do you have any favourite holiday destinations you like to go with me? Yeah, that I'd like to go with you. One of them actually, I'm really um, looking forward to my bear, you know, if you're if interested. I've got a few villas up there, north, north of my bear though. Do you stay in my bear anywhere? I don't actually go to my bear, I'm more of like a American type of guy, you know what I mean? What part of America? I like North Carolina's always the last, you know. Darling, I've got an AP five away from there. Really? It's right to you. So Can I, I just yeah. say, before we start, your hair, it's incredible, it's incredible, I love it, I love it. Really? Amazing, where'd you so get it done, nice. salon? Oh. I, got, I got hair on Broadway every other week, so. Do you? Yeah, give me Did you get your nails done there as well? What colour your nails? Is it a bit... Beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> they are beautiful. They're a bit of improvement needed on that. I do like girls who have nice nails, you know, I like them, yeah. 
So, so my ex is actually that they like to call them the claw grippers. <laughs> you enjoy you join the food, uh, Jake? Me? Parts enjoy a lot more. <laughs> this n waitress back Hello, there. ladies. What do you, you want, mate? Hi. Um, sorry. Listen, any beverages? Listen, I'm on a date. Yeah. Yes. Can you just give us some time, please? No drinks. Do you want a drink, babe? I'll just take two tap waters. So two tap waters? That'd be perfect, thank you, sir. Perfect. I'll let this is all for me. Okay. Great service, thank you. Thank, thank you. Here you go. Lovely. Thank you, sir. It's great. I ordered two drinks. No, I, I spoke with the waiter. I've got us one each. I think it'd be romantic. Oh, okay. Great. Anything else? Thank you. Hey, hey! What do you think you're doing? Get back. Get out of here. Sorry about that. Back to the date, babe. No Tuck worries. In. <laughs> so now you know a few things about me, obviously being a full time stud and that. Yeah. I'd like to know a few things about you, Luis. So what do you do for a living? So I'm usually kind of in marketing Monday to Friday, but yeah. from Friday night to Sunday I'm kind of a professional actress. Oh. Some sort of way. I'm one of my best friends are Margot Robbie. And... Yeah. So you like you like it on the FND? Yeah, we Margot Robbie comes round, chicken, chicken soup, canadalers. Listen, listen, I'm gonna pause you there. I'm doing nothing on Friday night. You're an actress. Teach me some of <laughs> it's lovely meeting you today, Jake. Um, had a lovely time. Likewise, Thank Louise. you so much. It was lovely meeting you. Thanks. It's a bit emotional. Year 13, I can't believe it's time to say goodbye. You've been so much fun and I've loved working with you all. Remember all the values and the speakers and the Yahadut lessons you've had, take them with you and go make an enormous difference wherever you go. Good luck and goodbye everyone. Always be the best versions of yourselves. I wish you good luck for the future. Year 13, wishing you the best of luck for the future. And remember, you might be leaving Yavna College, but Yavna College will never leave you. Remember, the Yavna College is always here for you.